What do you feel like has been the biggest key to Busco's success so far? Um, saying, I feel like when we're in like big situations that it is a struggle to win. We just need like staying calm is what one of our biggest like strong suits that we've had. Just to say, like I don't know, like if we get like too riled up, it like we automatically know it's going to go downhill. So just staying calm during each game really has helped us. Yeah, no question. Uh, taking a look at yourself personally, you surpassed 1,000 career kills last night. Um, how much of a point of pride is that for you, just to hit that career, hit that career milestone? Um, it feels pretty good just to get it. Like it's kind of a normal thing to do, like to get as a hitter. But it was, it was good to get it, and it, it's not just me who has to get it. It's my teammates around me that have to help me to get it. Because if you don't have a pass, you don't have a set, you don't get the kill. Well, speaking of those teammates, how much does it help having somebody like Arissa that's able to put you in those nice positions like that? Yeah, it's nice to have a setter that's able to move the ball around um, off the net, on the net, no matter where they are. The shoot you the ball is the biggest thing. Yeah, and just taking a look at the rest of the season, only a few weeks left to go before sectional starts. Where else do you feel like this team can continue to grow as you get ready for postseason play? Um, definitely all around, just setting. I'm not setting. Blocking and like passing is one of our... Blocking is not too important, but just to have a solid block up there is really important. And for passing, if you like, just staying low and ready for the passes is really going to be one of the biggest things that we have to focus on. Well, it feels like the NECC title is on the line next Tuesday when you host Angola. What are you most excited about when you welcome, you know, a highly ranked 3A program to Busco? Yeah, um, I'm excited to see my friends, but also for like just to have like one of the biggest matches that we've had all year is going to be really good. I think the only qu other question I've got, we kind of talked about this off camera, for you, we believe to be the first Busco volleyball player to commit to a Big Ten school. How much pride do you take in that, that uh, somebody from uh, from Busco can make it all the way to one of the country's biggest conferences? Yeah, um, from being a small town, it's like a big thing to go to Big Ten, and I'm excited to be at the next level because I know I could get there, so I wasn't going to let anything like stop me from going to the highest level as possible and just like this like the environment there is just like amazing i love it the coaches and the teammates are really good